to wear much of a wear, it's going to be hot. Shut it. Then I don't need a jacket. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Arthur. Tomara que a Júlia seja muito feliz com a escolha dela. I pooped my pants. Watch this. She's a wolf in mouse clothing. The mouse's ghostly howl stakes claim to Boots and pants and boots and pants. New shoes. Get yourself an outfit. Denim. Boots and pants and boots and pants. Haircut. New shoes. So get yourself back to school with these tails. Haircut. Hey buddy, we're at PetSmart. We're at, we're at PetSmart. You wanna to go to PetSmart, Captain? Over here somewhere in like New York, that's the ocean, Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> that's a little fishy. How could I ever acquire enough detail to make them think that it's reality? Have you ever had a dream that that you um you had you 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 could you do you you want you you could do so you you do you could you you want you want him to do you so much you could do anything. Time to feed my babies. <laughs> You've never seen the <laughs> Ha 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 ha!
Magic trick. Hands like that, so you can do. Yo, why is it that Cat Zingano is so hard to shake here? Half of Cat's torso is actually fused to the mat. She's also been able to distort her body in some positions that I can only describe as supernatural. Very grudge like Joe. Now, Joe, what technique is Junior Dos Santos utilizing here? Mike, he's pretending to be a turtle that can't flip over, he's trying to confuse Frank Mir. Frank looks very confused. Look for him to go for a takedown using only his feet, and he got it. Uh, this is interesting. Jones just pulled a mummy guard. Now he's trying to lure Alex in by casting a spell. He's showing incredible flexibility in his bones, Joe. Yeah, this kid is such a gifted athlete. Joe, what are the benefits of completely freezing your body during a fight with yourself? Well, one of the advantages is that your opponent is completely confused. He's unsure if you're a real person anymore, or just some sort of object that's fallen into the cage. And it is great for takedowns. As you can see, Cormier has landed two now. And the Iceman is back on his feet. This crowd is going crazy, Joe. Ow! Referee Eve Levine with a psychic knockout. Jones with a capoeira kick, and Gustafson responds with a merry-go-round. Incredible strength, Mike, and a total disregard for the laws of physics. Aldo with the big 1080 spin takedown. He's been landing those effectively all night, Joe. Gustafson is so elusive, Joe. We knew going into the rematch that Gustafson flipping through the air was going to give John Jones problems. He didn't want to admit it. They gave him fits in the first fight. And here he is again. He's getting flipped all over, Mike. Carmouche with a nice 70-foot sliding takedown. Oh, she's out, Joe. She's out, and Liz Carmouche doesn't realize it. Carmouche is going to town on the air. Those are nasty shots. Ronda taking a moment to catch her breath. Eve Levine looking intensely at the action. Carmouche is going to tire herself out, Mike. Ronda needs to be careful not to hit her in the back of the head. Right into a butt back mount. Big kick by Jones. Alex goes for a leg, gets a hold of a ghost that's been haunting the arena, and huge takedown. Gustafson shoots, and now he's showing off his sweet dance moves. I don't agree with that stand-up at all. At all. Eve Levine with the big win again, Joe. As it is time for this incredible woman to step into the role that she is meant to have. And we... We, all of us, are going to help her get there. Okay. Here she is! <laughs> hey guys! <coughs> have to talk, I'm so... <coughs> so some total jerkwad just said that my laugh was gross, so I turned around and I said, Yeah, well your face is gross. <laughs> That's just a stupid boulder! It's not just a boulder! It's a rock! You know, they say all men are created equal, but you look at me and you look at small Joe, and you can see that statement is not true. See, normally if you go one-on-one -on -one with another wrestler, you got a 50-50 chance of winning. But I'm a genetic freak, and I'm not normal, so you got a 25% at best at beating me. And then you add Kurt Angle to the mix, your chances of winning drastically go down. See, the three-way at sacrifice, you got a 33 and a third chance of winning. But I, I got a 66 and two-thirds chance of winning because Kurt Angle knows he can't beat me and he's not even going to try. So, Samoa Joe, you take your 33 and a third chance minus my 25% chance and you got an eight and a third chance of winning at sacrifice. But then you take my 75% chance of winning if we used to go one-on-one -on -one, and then add 66 and two-thirds percents. I got 141 and two-thirds chance of winning at sacrifice. See, Joe, the numbers don't lie, and they spell disaster for you at sacrifice. 
This is my new floater by Sherry, and I'm going to show you how it works. First, you put it on here. Then you press the lock it button. Step back. And then it'll fly up. Uh... Нет, это не... Firmly grasp it in your hand. Firmly grasp it. Firmly grasp it! Meow! Gotta get dead. Gotta get dead. Gotta get dip. Gotta get dip, 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 dip. You never had a chance to defeat me, fool, and you know why? Because you cheated? No! no. Hi, my name is Carla Shaw. You can stop at five or six stores or just one. I don't need friends, they disappoint me. Hi, I'm Todd LaRue. You could stop at five or six stores, or just one. I feel like a deer in the headlights of love. Honey, you've got a big storm coming. You could stop at five or six stores, or just one. You could stop at five or six stores, or just one. Can I ask you kind of a weird question? You could stop at five or six stores, or just one.